Hello, today I want to show you the latest Carbone build for the Sony Xperia Z. I will show it to you because it's Android 4.4.4. I've done a wipe data factory reset before, like you can see on the bottom of the screen. You only have to choose wipe data factory reset, clean install to a new ROM. Um, yes. So I've done it a few times before because the record was um, destroyed by my very good English. You maybe had mentioned it before. So I go to install zip, SD card, download, and you see a lot of zips in there. And I will take the latest carbone. So calculating MD5 sum. Let's see what happened. Now flash a new ROM. Press any key to continue. I'll... Yeah, yes. Thank you. So. Let's see what we could expect. So um, I didn't flash this build before. I downloaded it right away and put it on my SD card. Um, and yes. Now that's the first time I flash this build, so I don't know what happened. <laughs> um, so, um, okay, that was good. So I have now to install the Google Apps. So the G Apps I have some in my ROM folder. Let me see. So there are the 4.4 Paranoid Android gaps. Oh, hello. Thank you. So let's see what happened. Yes, I'm, I try a lot of ROMs. <laughs> yes. Um, I try a lot of ROMs and um, to f to find out which one fits personally at its best. So um, I always come back to Slimcat or Carbon because um, yes, I love these ROMs. I yes, they are really great and. Um, also, uh, Ultimate, uh, sorry, Existence ROMs are really great ROMs, but um, I always have a problem with the Sony style of uh, things. So, one little point uh, for me is the Quick, uh, are the quick settings. I, in my personal opinion, I, I think the new Sony quick setting style is so ugly. I yes. So um, I often choose custom ROMs like um, Slimcat or. Carbon, so these both kinds of ROM are the most stable to me. Um, ROMs like uh, Android Ice Code Project or Dirty Unicorn or Paranoid Android, they uh, that are also really, really, really great ROMs, but. I really have, uh, I really often had problems like reboots and soft reboot uh, reboots, uh, mostly during nights. So um, I mentioned that uh, it's too late in the morning. So yes. So here we are. That's the setup for. Uh, I'm sorry. I would choose the English one for this ROM. So, 
I have to fill in my Wi-Fi password so I skip this option skip anyway so yes I have a Google account but I won't not now so I have to fill in my name Panorama Google service your phone is ready so what happened here it's my home screen okay looks good to me so on top is paranoid androids hover I switch it on so let's see what we happened here here's the setting menu so with is on carbon fibers themes sound packs looking good so about the phone you can see the android 4.4.4 version so let's see if something happened in the settings yes okay just wanna switch through the carbon fibers to see if um, something generally had changed so not now you can you change the navigation bar persistence pi control oh, sorry. So you see, I just try how snappy are the ROM is and how the ROM works and uh, maybe take some settings I will choose later on. So looks great, really snappy, great performance great for me first look at these rom is really 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 great thanks for that themes looks good great oh yeah so uh, for me the rom really looks fantastic it's quick it has a great performance it's snappy everything looks fine for me like you can see it's my first try so so I have not done a, a lot of things camera looks good with photosphere over great I'm really excited so I hope uh, I can uh, that I could give you a little insight in this new build and how it works and how and what uh, settings you can take by yourself. So thanks for listening. Thanks for uh, <laughs> yes. Thanks for um, joining my video and yes. Stay tuned. Next review will come in just one day. Thanks for watching, good night.